In the last video, we briefly mentioned Artillery's Universal Modulator, which gives us a huge range of creative possibilities for working with effects. Nearly every effect parameter can be controlled by the Universal Modulator. Let's see how it works. Here's a drum loop with the vowel filter effect applied. This time we'll choose Toggle for the key mode, so that when we hit a note on our controller, it stays down until we hit it again. The envelope follower here uses the actual audio signal input as a modulation source. In other words, the vowel B parameter is being driven by the constantly changing amplitude envelope of the original audio input. Gain is the amount of modulation applied to the parameter. Small attack and release times make for a tighter response, while larger times can create a sort of whiplash effect. The vowel mix parameter is being driven by an LFO. Under the display, you can change the waveform, rate, rate fade-in, amount fade-in, and slope. The Universal Modulator also includes a five-stage envelope generator to give you even more control possibilities. In addition to the Universal Modulator, we can add key tracking so that the target parameters also change according to what notes within the effect zone you play. Legendary trance gate effects are easy to set up using Artillery's Amp Effect with the Universal Modulator. Here is a simple synth chord progression sound without any effects applied to it. Now we'll drop in the Amp Effect with the Step Sequencer in the Universal Modulator. Set the speed and number of steps right here. Nearly all of Artillery's parameters can be easily assigned to your MIDI controller's knobs via MIDI Learn. Just right-click on the parameter you want to assign. Thanks for watching the Artillery videos. We hope you've enjoyed yourself and wish you a lot of creative fun with Artillery.